out there, my name is Mark Ranger, and I'm very excited today to share with you my initial impressions of the Notch Pro Access gear bag. Um, been looking for a gear bag for a while, and really this Notch bag um, presented the most options in order to get as much of my gear in one bag as possible, uh, including the ability to put this on your back and carry this over distance. Um, First impression, this seems to be really durable material, really heavy weight, uh, but light at the same time. I feel like, um, you know, in some of those places we've got single stitching, which we'll see over time how that holds up. I'm not sure, but it, it feels solid. Uh, these buckles are a little bit different. I've never seen anything quite like them. Um, you tilt them to the side and slide them out to open them up, which, um, with many of my backpacks, it's been one of the first things to go. The plastic buckles get smashed one way or another. Um, the opening to this is a little bit unique as well. Uh, it's almost like a hood. So once we open this up, I feel like this top little pocket probably offers the best shelter from the storm, so to speak. I often find myself working in the rain here in the Pacific Northwest. And to have a spot where I can keep my phone and my keys, got to keep them out of the elements, it's great. these straps are pretty easy to take on and off. Uh, I haven't experimented with that just yet, but it looks like if you just pop them through the shackles here, down at the bottom, these are just girth pitch on, so we can just slide those out. Pretty cool. Seems like the padding here on the back is pretty nice. Space for ventilation. Um, I not only wanted a day in and day out bag, but also one where I could haul my gear um, over distance to get to some remote climbs. So let's uh, open this up and see what it looks like on the inside. Really solid Velcro. And voila! All your gear in one place. I like these see through pockets. The mesh seems to be pretty heavy, dirty, <laughs> heavy duty. Uh, this will probably be heavy and dirty here soon. Uh, but good places to be able to see things uh, speed line kit, uh, senders. We've got tons of daisy chains here to clip things in. It seems like uh, there's enough room here maybe to go ahead and put a rope bucket inside the bag, harness on top, helmet. Lots of places to organize, uh, lots of options. Seems like no matter where you look, there's a place to hook something. Get a sleeve out here on the outside to put a handsaw. I'll load this up with some gear and uh, see what it looks like to have all my tools organized. I'll share that with you as well. Thanks for watching.